Out have had six of them. <laughs> Who's that in the painting? Who with his family now? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, hangouts. Yes, yes, yes. We are back, and this time we're gonna do a throwback. So we voted the bank the best burger in London 2017. We're gonna come back to the bank and see if they're still making that same amazing burger that won the crown, right? Because a lot of lot in the burger scene has changed in London, right? So we want to come back and check it, and I'm we'll see if it's if it's good or not. So Iqbal, you ready? I'm ready. You're dressed to. Out dressed us to all go. dressed up. We're yeah, all ready. Go, let's go. Let's go. Who's that in the painting? There's someone's moving. Wait. Listen, it's a boo. He's trying to get to HH. A boo, <laughs> we're here. Ah, oh, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He always said he didn't want to have cameras out before dinner. Now the cameras are right. He's trying to get out. But that was that. So the table was set, quick look at the menu, ordered, and in no time at all, the food came to the table and it came dressed to impress, especially the burger. So we had sea bass on a bed of celeriac. We had an amazing burger. We had truffle fries and we had dynamite prawns. Look at that spread. This was the burger voted best burger in London 2017. Still looks good. Iqbal, move your finger from the camera. Never give Iqbal the camera, but it didn't stop me biting into the burger. Bed crumb as usual. And then Iqbal took a little bite and he was happy. But then he had another look and he was looking for the breadcrumbs. Couldn't find them. Oh, sorry. Empty plates. And happy faces. And full, full, full <laughs> tummies. Full bellies. Full bellies. Hello, Hangouts. We've just come outside the bank. Eat Bell, how was the feud? Well, I had a burger. And I must say, it was a very good Wagyu burger. However, it had nothing on the burger that you could get here before. I was break. I was, you know, breaking it open. I was expecting some mustard seeds in there. It wasn't. It wasn't nothing like the old one. But however, a very good one. But I'll tell. I wanted to tell him about this sea bass that we had. So the bank has gone through a transformation. When we came here back in 2017, we voted this place the best burger in London. It's no longer the best burger in London. I, I can say that hands down. There are many, many places that are pushing the boundaries, and this isn't like the place you come for burger. However. The food they are serving is of a different caliber. It's pushing on fine dining and they've got some really great items on the menu. And I've heard the menu is changing as well. So keep an eye out for that. So they serve this sea bass dish to us, which is this beautiful sea bass coiled up on a bed of seriac uh, puree um, with caviar. Uh, it just looked spectacular. It looked amazing, but it didn't taste that great. I wouldn't say I wouldn't go out my way for that right so the thing that killed it was the caviar it's just over the top you know it didn't add much to the dish you know I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend it but I would recommend their dynamite prawns oh my god their dynamite prawns are dynamite they're gonna blow your taste buds away the dynamite prawns are something to come to this place for I've right, so, had six of them. Yeah, six. six of them. They're so plump. The sauce is so tangy. The chili on top. Everything just makes it. So, overall, for taste, this place is going to get a four star. Four star. Service was amazing. I mean, super fast. Super, super fast. fast. You're going to get served within. We got to give. Up we got. Five. We got served within a few minutes, right? So that's like that never happened to me yeah. before. So I'm going to say I'm going to give that's a five. five that's star. a five solid star. five. Solid five, five, five star. Um, for price. Now bring your piggy bank to this place, right? It's, you're gonna, 
it's going to be expensive. Looking right? about so what, 50, 50 pound a head? 50 pound a head, yeah. 50 pound a head. But then you are coming, you're going to get dressed up. The bouncer's going to say, look you up and down. Do you have a reservation? It's 10 pounds to get a reservation, right? So that's, that kind of gives you an eye of, of what this place is about. And you've seen what it looks like inside. So that was our review. Hello Hangouts. Remember, subscribe, like, share. And uh, if you see Abu Shaz, point him in the re direction <laughs> of Hello Hangouts. We haven't seen him for a while. Come back, guys. All right. That's that. We're out. Peace.